Residents in the West Chatham community are speaking out after three homes were burglarized within a month. Yeah, Metro Police say the numbers though for burglaries are down. WJCL's Ashley Lincoln talked to police and residents on avoiding becoming a victim. Ashley? That's right, Kevin and Jennifer. The resident you're about to hear from said he was only gone for less than an hour before returning to a home invaded by bandits. Patrick Wells says he's been living in this West Chatham home for 14 years and never had a break in until last week. It made me angry. It made me very upset. He's the third out of three homes burglarized in the Laura Oaks neighborhood. Thieves took off with jewelry, a laptop, and nearly $1,000 in cash. A Shriner, he says the money was for the Shriners Hospital. To realize that they had stolen from children and, and the hospitals that we uh, collect for and support, uh, that made me even matter. Overall, burglaries are down. Metro Police tell us more than 1,800 burglaries were reported in 2013. This time last year, there were 1,200 in Savannah. Currently, over 900 home break-ins have occurred this year. They're down like over 220 from last year. However, there are still 900 people who were burglarized and they don't care that burglaries are down. In the past two months, nearly 50 happened in West Chatham. First off, they invaded my home and uh, they endangered uh, what could have been our lives. Police say having an alarm system, neighborhood watch, and keeping valuable items out of sight will help deter thieves. You can also call that same crime prevention officer and arrange a time free of charge for him or her to come to your house and walk around and show you specifically things you can do. Welsh and his neighbors say they're making adjustments so they won't become targets again. We did not have an alarm system, but we are purchasing one. Um, our neighbors have purchased one. Uh, my wife yesterday went and purchased a, a handgun. We've been walking around the neighborhoods being seen. We're not going to take, take this and we're not going to stand for it. And we'll have a list of tips and numbers on our website for you to check out to avoid becoming a target. You can visit all that information at WJCL.com. Kevin and Jennifer. All right. Thank you, ma'am. Sounds good. Thanks, Ashley. Meantime, we are working for you.